This video is going to briefly give you an overview of PictoChart, which is a very great platform for developing infographics and other types of graphic supplements that you can use for instruction. One of the nice things about PictoChart is it interfaces very well with Google and all of the Google tools. For those of you that are working in Google education platforms a lot, it's a great way to have things interface easily. So I would recommend you go to the PictoChart site, signing in with your Google account would probably be recommended. And it takes you to the primary dashboard. You're going to go to templates and you're going to create an infographic. That's what we're doing with this project. So you can either start from a blank and, and add L whatever elements you want to, or you can start from a particular template. So let's choose a template. So then with this particular template, you can go through and modify all the different portions that you want. You can click change numbers. You can change fonts here at the top, bolding, alignments, things of that nature, uh, how opaque it displays on the screen. You can go through and design and add various components. If it doesn't have components that you like for your infographic, you can add pieces and it does tell you those that are free with the free version and those that are the upgrade pro version. It gives you various design components you can work with, charts you can work with, maps, different countries, for example, if you're doing something with history or geography. And styles has to do with the color schemes that it uses. So it allows you to customize any of these templates to whatever you want to do for your particular project. Once you're finished, you're going to select download. Now it's important to remember this is that with the free plan, you have a limited number of downloads on which you can, can download your, your finished product. So what I would recommend doing is be sure that you have all of your components put together as you want them before you download. So you don't run into this, Oh, I messed that up. Oh, I messed that up. And then you run out of downloads and, and have to purchase a, a, a limited license for the, for the software. So that's basically an overview of PictoChart, which you'll be using for this assignment.